we're going to make a bunch of shaped windows and ensure that they're aligned at their tops. And this is going to be a really easy process. First up, I want to draw a couple of what I call inference lines. So we're going to use the line tool. And we do, could do a couple things here where we ensure that we have enough room for the header profile that we want to do in there. Of course, I can drop something out, kind of bring it in this way. I'd have to have a 4 and 12 for an allowed angle to get this absolutely accurate. But I'm just going to say that I've got an 11 and a half inch header uh, plus three inches of plates here. Okay, so I want to make sure that my line that I'm going to use for an inference is just lower than that line, and that's fine. Let me draw this line out. I'm going to use tab or enter and then get into this angle category and type in for in 12. That's going to get me that line. So next thing I want to do is I'm going to draw a center line of where I want to place my window, and then I can use that from here to set a multiple copy and set my interval 60 inches in is fine for this case and we'll drag this out okay now i'm going to highlight this line up here use my extend tools draw a line through these lower lines so that they extend up to this line as a fence and then i can take my window tool drop this in on that center line open it up get to the shape panel click on match roof now that that is matched, if my bumps are turned off, I can drag this up till I hit this intersection. If we know our snaps, we highlight over these snaps over here, you can see that's the intersection snap. Now I can still use that multiple copy interval to drag out these windows and then select this window. Same thing, going to hit that intersection snap. You can see here we've got a ceiling in this building that's interfering with these windows. Not a bother, I can fix that later. Now, just to match this on the other side, I might draw down a center line reference so that I can select all three windows, copy, reflect about that center line. There we go. Now we have windows that are matching the slope of this roof and they're aligned at their tops perfectly. So this is a really quick and easy way to do this. Now let's say that we have to make some adjustments. Maybe one of these um, windows has to move by a certain amount of of inches say that this had to move over three inches well we can always grab this line reference make sure that it's centered on this window and extend it up till it hits that intersection now select the window and make your new snap there we go now it's still aligned at the top hopefully that's helpful